Can we can we stop talking about this m game for flipping overpaid and honestly? I mean, if you love football, what about your little local team? Go and support them. West Ham are my little local team, and I do support them. We're <laughs> two one. Come on, two one down. Two one up. But we are. Oh, what was running. the name of that that guy who was having a go at me? What was his name? Which one? There's quite a few tonight. Oh, go on. Uh, Notting Nottingham, from... Nottingham legend. Yeah, the Man U fan. Yeah. From Nottingham. Yeah, what did he say? Remind me. Um, basically, you shouldn't call football fans yobbos because most of us aren't. And he, he was absolutely... I wasn't referring to He was classist. Nice, was you were classist. To this guy called Nottingham legend. Yes. Who I think should give us a call. Come on, Mr. Nottingham legend. Give us a call. Well, strangely enough, he's on the line now. <laughs> Brilliant. Hiya. Hello. Nottingham legend, good evening. Yes. Um, What's your real name? <laughs> my real name is Jordan. Jordan. Hello, Jordan. Um, Thanks I'm for a, calling. Yeah, I'm, I'm a, I just wanted to basically say, James, like, look, I'm not a massive football fan either, which Dawn uh, noticed very quickly with my name on Twitter. <laughs> um, and, and I'm going to, you know, I'm not going to lie to you, right? I do think, obviously, I agree that not right what they did on the pitch there that's wrong isn't it of course right totally um, but what i would say is i think people feel very strongly about football and to say that they're yobbos over this it, it's really kind of dismissive and it, uh, it's not you james you're not a dismissive guy yes he is is he yes oh, james. take my word for it <laughs> he called me well, I'm certainly I, I'm uh, shush a minute, Dorney, please. Um, <laughs> certainly, I am because I have. Uh, I'm dismissive about yobbos, and if you run on a pitch, slash a policeman's face, throw smoke canisters around, and behave like a yobbo, that is what I'm going to call you. Now, I'm not. I'm not calling everybody that turns up like Dorney to a football match a yobbo. Obviously, there are some people who who you know, don't have to be entertained that much. They can go and see blokes kicking a ball around and that really gets them excited. And that's, in a free world, they can do what they like. But I can assure you, uh, not. why are you a legend, by the way? Well, uh, it's a stupid name, isn't it, really? It could, it could be worse. You could be Whaley. I mean, that's a stupid name. <laughs> Johnny, thank you. Yes, dear. Yeah, uh, okay, sorry, it. Nottingham. Uh, yeah, well, I quite like Dawny, don't you? But anyway, why are you a legend? Why am I a legend? Um, because I have, um, well, to be honest with you, James, I'm not sure. Um, I just am. Oh, come on. You can't not be sure if you're going under the name oh, right. of uh, legend. I'll tell you something, James. I, I'm, I've, I've just got a bit of an ego. Nothing wrong with that, is there, James? Not something I know about. No, so quite. There we are. Oh, I, that, that's, that's, I figured that would be the best way to explain it to Mm. Um, so what do you do as a legend? Uh, well, I'm a law student at Trent, and it's uh, very difficult, and I think that gives oh, me legendary God. status. Law. Do we need yeah. any more lawyers? No. I don't know. Well, no, I, was, I, I would agree with that. I'm going to cause chaos. <laughs> um, I'm sure you are. Uh, let me ju just before Dawn, who is a football fan and so can't be taken seriously on this discussion, <laughs> um, let, me, um, let me just uh, uh, say if... If you don't call those people who invaded the pitch yobbos, and by the way, before we go any further, what is this about being classist? Ah. I mean, as far as I'm concerned, there is no class system. It is only perpetuated by nuts and idiots who think there is a class system. Dawn probably what? considers she's working class, what? but she isn't. Carry on. Right. So what I'll say is... Um... <sighs> Look, I, 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 this is a very fundamental issue you're talking about here. But if you if you're going to if no, it's not. It doesn't exist. No, no, because look, there is a class system. There are people who are who only in your mind, Jordan. only in the minds of people who think there is. Right. Well, there's a guy called. I mean, look, I don't like bringing this guy up because he's very unpopular. But there's a guy called Karl St Marx. Stay. Listen. Very... No. No. Nottingham, whatever, legend, stay there. I'm going to talk to you after the news because I have to go for a break and if I cut you off now, I haven't had as much fun with you as I want.
But let's get back to the thing that we're really going to nail you on this time. Um, the Nottingham legend is with us, and uh, he's Jordan. a big fan <laughs> of... He is a big fan. They put his name on the screen, look. Yeah. Um, I hope he's got a photo shot of that. Uh, he's, he's accused me of being classist, which I find really annoying. I might find a good lawyer and sue him. Um, so, L Legend, explain yourself. Now, <laughs> I, if I did call I've you... I've given you loads of time to think about it. Yeah, yes, I have. And do you know what? You are not classic, but what you did in calling football fans yobbos was... No, that's on. That's lawyer Let's get speak, this right, isn't Jordan. That is lawyer speak. Yeah. Let's get this right, Jordan. I was referring okay. to the people who broke in onto the pitch, slashed a policeman, I'm told. I didn't know that at the time. Now they're even worse yobbos. And behaved appallingly. They are yobbos. <sighs> right. I think one of my bosses so, is a big football fan. I've got to be very careful. Quite Look, a few of your bosses I mean, are. Do you hmm. really think it's right that... Um, the, the fans who have, have been basically supporting and keeping these clubs going for so long should be responded to when they protest that the very clubs that they support should be responded to with essentially, oh, you know, the police. It, it, it might be private property. Well, what are you going to do? Let the, I beg your pardon. So if, if somebody doesn't like me and they come round and demonstrate outside my house, if they break in, I should just allow them to do that, should I? No, because you, that's your private house, James, that you live in. But this is a football ground that has changed hands, you know, it, you know realistically. You're going to make a sh shocking, that wasn't the word I was going to use, but let's favor the broadcasting, uh, you are going to make a shocking lawyer, aren't you? Well, James, uh, that's, uh, that's your opinion. I couldn't possibly comment. Now that is like that. You're going to that, make that's... an even worse lawyer. <laughs> that is that lawyering. is even worse. That's lawyering. I'm rolling you up. I'm going to make a fantastic lawyer, mate. Don't you worry about that. Well, look, you've got your name on screen, which is brilliant. But, I mean, yeah, I agree. Look, if you break in and you behave in a criminal way, then that makes you a yob. So I agree with James, and I'm going to go and kill myself afterwards for agreeing with him. But just <laughs> She's call... so violent. Oh, yeah, but, 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 but. She wants to put a choke chain on me. No, I said my and husband. Oh, but, well, they're actually, now we're, now we're talking. <laughs> look, I think. So me and your husband, you would put a choke chain what? on. I need a lawyer. Yes. Jordan, talk to him about choke chains. Choke chains are, um, Don't bother. Uh, you know, obviously <laughs> probably rather unethical to be used on a person. Uh, I, I don't think that's a good idea. But at the same time, it's dawn. So we can, can make exceptions. Thank you. We can make exceptions. No worries. Here. What class are you, uh, legend? I mean, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm not a massive football fan, and I'm doing a law degree. So put two and two together, I'm quite well off. Um, but I, I just think that... Like, Doesn't matter. Well, no, 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 listen to me. You've got nothing to do yeah. with money. What class are you? I would call myself middle class, I, I guess. Okay. I, I don't really think of it as a useful descriptor. But when we're talking about, you know, language, it's a different story, isn't it? No, not really. What class would you call Dawn? Careful. Obviously, uh, <laughs> Dawn is a working class individual. I'm dead Why? posh, cheeky so and so. Oh, sorry, uh, Dawn. Sorry, I was just trying to be shrewd. Uh, she's dead posh. Yeah, Dawn is dead posh class. Dead posh. Hmm. You see, I don't have any class. But what class would you label me as? I don't, I don't like labelling people when they don't like being labelled, James. But I guess no, I probably... you don't cop out now, Jordan. You oh, start. Okay. Sorry, you know legend. Lady? You are thinking rich, aren't you? So I suppose I'm not as well off as Dawn. No, probably just stinking. To not be honest as well with you, off as Dawn. You were on Big Brother, buddy. Me, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, I'm, I'm, I made I'm... a few bob out of out of Big Brother, but then I also paid a lot of tax out of Big Brother, and. Um, oh. Good on you. You know, so... <laughs> well, this, is, this is the thing with the cold class debate, right? Is it where you are now and the lifestyle you are leading now, i.e. like you being at university, Jordan, um, me sort of like, you know, working in the media, or is it where you're from, your background, your, your, background, your upbringing? Back yeah. That's a new word. Um, your upbringing, your background 
is that what defines <clears throat> your class? Because that defines your viewpoint on life, doesn't it? So is it where you come from or where you end up that defines your class? So what I would say is, I mean, class is like James says, a thing that we, it's a social construct. We created it, we perpetuate it. Um, and I think that what, what class is really, when we're trying to describe what, people, what class people and we're trying to identify how well off they are. And that's kind oh. of a sort of measurement. So it's something that realistically, I don't think you, I don't think you're born with it. I think you can change. But, you know, because we have social mobility, people can get successful and become well off in this country, can't they? Yeah, but it doesn't change your class. And money is no definition of your class, is it? Because, you know, if we're talking about football, you've got footballers who've come from very, very working class backgrounds who have loads of money. But I would still describe them as working class lads. Well, this, look, I mean, I'll tell you why I struggle with this. Um, I mentioned that right now I'm quite well off and doing a law degree, but I wasn't before, um, you know, and, and I feel like... I feel like I and, you know, my family as well, we were able to work very, very hard and move up the scale. Exactly. And I think that is the true definition of working class, because if you're genuinely working class, you want to work to better yourself. And I think we should forget this whole thing of class, because there are lots of people who, who just go on and on about their class um, as an excuse for not doing anything no, or getting no, no, anywhere. No, 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 because and that is not true. I because think, no, because uh, it is true. It's not true because there because is, you disagree there doesn't a, mean it's not true. No, because I am disagreeing because I am disagree. right. I'm right. No, that, you're not I right. I'm right, James. You can't be right against me. That is not <laughs> actually sociably possible. Yes, it is because I'm just doing it. Um, but yeah, there is a class system in this country, and you are discriminated. There from. is. But we want to get rid of it. We want to get rid of it, but no, we're not doing for, very for, well, for, are we? You are well, well, that's because of people like you. Why? 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 Why is it down to me? Go on. Because you love it. No. It's you not, love it. It's you like, love the fact you can say, I'm working class. Well, I, uh, look. You the, love it. No, but the, 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 you love it. You get, get a get kick rid. out of it. <laughs> Absolute <laughs> kick out of it. Uh, James, there are many things I get a kick out of, but discussing the class system is one of them. But if you want to talk about choke chains again, you might be onto a winner. <laughs> Jordan, I've got to go. Good to talk to you. Sorry, have the last word, Jordan. Go on quickly. Privilege. Um, yeah, what I would just say is, like, uh, just have a bit more empathy when you're talking about people loving something they're really passionate about and wanting to show... Sorry, that. sorry, Jordan. Go, Jordan. Did, Jordan. I, did I ask... Jordan... Get the heck off my show now. <laughs> Go. You're a stupid, stuck-up idiot.